Ooh, wee, it's been a great day. That's just how it is at Oregon Tech Built. And this is where I am today. Your hard workout or doing something that you didn't think you could ever do. I love this sport. I mean, it's a part of who I am. Here is the day in the life of Hannah Waller, a Oregon track and field athlete. Good morning, it's currently 7 a.m. So I'm gonna get up and I'm gonna brush my teeth, I'm gonna get ready. I have about an hour and 10 minutes before practice starts, but if you're early, you're on time. If you're on time, you're late. And because we like to get si surprise hydration tests, I'm just gonna drink one of these right now. Now I'm making my way out the door to go for a bike. Found a bike. I'm gonna click my playlist. I have to get my temperature checked and I have to get wristbanded in order to get cleared to come into the facility. Any symptoms? Uh, no. Wristband. <laughs> Thank you. So. This is about the time I have to pretty much stop filming because at this point I will either get yelled at or yelled at. Just got done with weights. How do my edges look, guys? I think they held up. So this is the weight room. Super cool. All right, just got done with weights. I am about to go home and ride this bicycle because I have tutoring at 10 o'clock. Bye! I've made it home with 10 minutes to spare. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> now that I'm home and I'm drinking my protein drink, I'm going to log on and get into it. I just finished up tutoring. I just got done taking an exam in my math class and it's about time for lunch. Pasta, yes. Bon appetit. I don't know if I want to watch The Amazing Race or if I want to watch Hall Halloween Baking Championship it is. We also asked them to include one additional mid churro mummy. My dad, decoration on the top. And just like that, we have a clean plate. I only know how to clean plates. I love lunch. Eat it at the right time. Gives me the right energy for practice. So next time you see me guys, I will be getting ready for practice and I'll be on my way to the track. It's actually a little warmer outside than it was in the house. <laughs> so later today I'm probably gonna get a heater because I don't have a heater. This is what's on my playlist right now. Love Young Thug. Made it to the track, I have to put my mask on, and yeah, practice will be starting shortly. Walking to the training room and just seeing all the prestige. Wonderful. I'm about to get some rehab and treatment. Practice will be starting soon. It's incredible to know that this is my home every day. Together, we have witnessed history. Together, we will make history. Alright, so we are coming back inside now from doing some exercises outside. This is my view, my gorgeous view. We're going to be doing some accelerations and we're going to cool down and be done for the day. I have just finished practice and I am now with my teammate Jamie. Oh, we're kind of 20! Hey, we have the same idea! So I'm just here watching my teammates get ready for their run. Oh, you guys are in my video! Say hi! Woo! It's a good day. This is a really good Friday. Can't you say the same? 
yeah. For sure. For sure. <laughs> so I'm just here watching my teammates do their time trial. Oh, she's coming in strong. Look at her. Ooh, yes, come on, come on, come on! Woo! Let's go, guys! My guy is out in the front. That's what I like to see. I like this energy. So I'm making my way home now because, you know, the distance time trial is over. Bye ladies, I'll catch you soon. Bye. Some hot dogs and some french fries for dinner because <laughs> I really, really wanted to um, have a fun dinner tonight. This fast forward, people need to make their way to this plaza at night, just wrap my hair up. Then I grab my bonnet here, wrap my ponytail up in here, and I swing it around, wash my face. I like to dab it all across my face. I just get a little bit. And this is what keeps our skin clear. Now that I've done my nighttime routine, I've shown you my whole day. I can finally get underneath the covers, tuck myself in, put my blinders on, and go to sleep. Fast forward, it's now March 10th. Um, I am no longer running for the Oregon track team um, as I've made the decision to opt out of this season. I felt like it was more important for me to work on myself um, and to work on the person that I wanted to be. Last year, I had been diagnosed with depression, probably the most chronic depression I've ever had in my life, and I just felt like I could not be the best athlete that I could be. I felt like my whole life was consumed by being number one, and I wasn't thinking about my own self and what it takes to be number one in my life. So I just really wanted to say thank you to everybody who has been there for me. Um, you guys are so appreciated to me and I don't know what I would do without you. I'm still very, very, very proud of the things that I was able to do with the amazing women on my team. And I don't know what I would do if it wasn't for this school. I wouldn't be here, but it doesn't matter because I'm still here. So on that note, let's go Ducks. <laughs> And I'm gonna get out of here. <laughs> Bye.